Hey everybody, it's BC here, and welcome to another episode of Sea of Craft. And we're currently continuing on with the campaign right now. We're just getting into the blasting cannons, and we got to use these things to destroy some obstacles. So we're going to go ahead and do that. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to just get rid of all these crossbows, because I don't think I'm going to actually need them. Now, I do believe that, yeah, as you can see, the crossbow is heavy. This blasting cannon is super. So this is going to be... Extremely heavy. Let's actually get the center mass up and see what it actually does to it. Now, I don't. It'd be nice if it actually updated it while it was actually on the block. But I have a feeling it's not going to be as heavy as I thought. So I could be. Should be okay with this. Or what I can do. Possibly. Let's. Let's have some fun. Let's see if we can get two of them on here. Well. Keep the weight closer to the middle so they're not too far off center. I think I can actually hit the helm, so find out about that. Uh, we're a little on the heavy side. So let's see if we can actually fix that. Let's take that off. And we'll go ahead and place uh, a couple more barrels here. My mouse would actually work. One there, and uh, it's not going to let me because of the propeller. Hmm. Can I do here? Oh, it's the other barrel that's in the way. Aha. So we can do that. Get rid of that. Go ahead and place these on. Uh, oh. This one's off. That one's gotta go. That one's gotta go. And I actually have to grab the right block. Do that, that, that. Uh, center mass is not too bad. I want to keep it obviously back heavy slightly just to keep the keep it uh, keep it from I guess capitalizing. Uh, I can't remember what the actual term was, but I know there was something with a uh, with boats where if the the front of the hull dips down in the water, the boat will actually flip flip over, and I can't remember what it was. Uh, anyway. Let's see how this does. Let's see if it actually floats. Barely. Let's go here and boom. Take it down in one shot. Oh, I just gotta grab a crystal on this one. Oh. Uh oh. Oh. Uh oh. I'm disorientated. Nice. Come on, go. And I'm capsized. Yay. Oh, <laughs> finish lines right here. Upside down, but I still still finished. Okay, what do we have next? Alright. Crystal charge crystals with lasers to open doors in twenty seconds. Okay, so in other words, destroy the obstacles. Alright. Sounds fair enough. And I like that too, that you can't... Let's <laughs> try that again. I capsize myself. That's what happens when you're trying to do two things at once. Not paying attention to my boat. Hmm. Redesigns in order on this one. Okay, let's try that. Put a couple of pontoons on the side. See if we get a little more stability. I might have to move the center mass a little bit further, but let's see how we do here. I'll try to pay attention to my driving as well. As that is the issue. Hold on, what? Yeah, I should get, get a challenge for doing this by loading it up with weight. Let's try this. Let's see what the 10 lead blocks do. So I've got six or four of them on there already. Let's see here. Let's actually get the center mass up. Oh, that's not what I want. Let's go to center mass. Get, uh, let's see here. Do one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight. 
Uh, as far as I know, I'm still buoyant, so let's see what happens. Actually, let's take that one out. I'll move it up front, because I want to try to stop it from going up like that. Okay, let's see what this does. Besides sink. Behemoth. Yeah, there's no way I'm doing this in 15 seconds. Let me, get to Let me try some more engine, more propellers. Okay, let's try that. I figure if I got propellers in the front, maybe it'll, it'll do a little more pulling and go a little bit better. Hmm. Buoyancy is an issue. Okay, that's a little bit better. Let's try this. Without flipping over. <laughs> Alright, need a little more weight in the front. Oh, that's the wrong block. Let's do this. Uh, take that one out. I actually place that in the wrong block. Ugh. Okay, let's try this again. That's ah, not gonna happen. Alright, well, let's just finish this off and go up and move on to the next one. We got a little overboard on this. Yeah, it's definitely heavy. That's what I have for have that's what I get for having two cannons. <laughs> Let me try this with one cannon. Maybe that's my problem. Oh, that's the wrong button. That isn't. Let me go here. Oh yeah, there's the big giant sword you put on here is basically a giant spike. So yeah. Like I said it's basically it's pretty much besiege. You get more Get more blocks unlocked. That's in the wrong spot. I'll get there eventually. Be patient. There we go. Won't be in the 15 seconds. But we'll get there eventually. For the like, 20th time. Okay. What's next? Rotating mirror. Use lasers to recharge crystals to open the door. So we have to pa pass this in 60 seconds. Uh, keep the torch from being extinguished by water. Oh. Well then, I guess I better get rid of all these lead weight. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to submerge it instantly. Alright, now, what else do I have to do? Uh, hmm. Oh. I have to push him. Alright, well, let's see if I can do this. Can I actually fire it? No. Uh, I guess that's what I have to do. I have to drive my boat right up to it. Yeah. This is kind of cool. I like this. I'll try to do this too at the same time without submerging my boat. Oh. Okay. Uh, let's uh, turn around and go down to this one over here. And let's see here. It's a shame I can't hit this with the cannon. Yeah, so I gotta rotate this a little bit and I gotta go hit back to the other one because that's apparently in the wrong spot. Okay, that actually might be it right there. Uh, boat's a little bit big. And of course I'm, I'm no pilot. Come on. Okay. Oh, captain I should say, not a pilot. I've never done this before, can you tell? There we go. And now I gotta go down here and adjust this one. And this one just needs a slight nudge. Oh, what do you mean? I think it's still lit. Alright, let's try this again. Took too long. The game decided, "Oh, you're not. You're not gonna do this." 
I wasted my time by trying to shoot this thing a few times, that's why. Yeah, let's, let's get this right on the first try here. And, okay. Let's spin around. Gotta love that counter steer. Okay. And this should be fairly simple. Oh, maybe not. Went a little bit too far. And I jumped out of the water. Come on. Oh, so finicky. Very finicky. I swear. Uh, you just gotta blow on it. There we go. <laughs> you have got to be kidding me. <laughs> oh my god. That's going to be the wrong way too. <sighs> Hang on. Okay. I got it this time. There we go. And look at that, I actually might actually get a gold on this one for a change. Haha, -ha, gold star. I'm special. Okay. And I, I only did one more try after that, so. Now we got the, the harpoon, the hook, the grappling hook. What is that? Is that a basketball? Five basketballs. Uh, okay, put five basketballs in the basket. Tell Transport two balls to the basket at a time and pass checkpoint in 90 seconds. Okay, I've never actually used this part, so. Does it like throw when you release or does it drop? No, no, I actually used it before. Uh, hang on. What do I do to configure this? Hmm. Oh, that's the wrong one. Guess I can do it that way. Gotta love physics. Uh, hmm. That's what I'm supposed to do here. Where's the basketball net? Oh. Oh, okay. Well, let's, uh. Don't really need the hook for this. Maybe I do. Let's try something here. Uh, let's actually take this off. And we'll place... Place a block here. Ah, uh, maybe one more block. And then we go over here to the hook. Where was that? Uh, here. Alright. Okay, let's not go over the ball. Alright, that worked. Let me go over here. G to release. Okay. Go over here. Oh, wow, this thing is like super bouncy. I might have to... Saying, oh yeah, the barrels I have on the front here, I might have to get rid of them. Alright, release that one. And get stuck, because I'm an idiot. Alright, flip, I'm like a pro. And that was bad. Okay, slight redesign, take some buoyancy out of the front, move the hook down, let's try this again. And also try to drive a little slower too. Oh, that's really stuck in there. Okay, we'll drop that. And then let's see if we can free that. And there we go. And free my balls, right? Balls can't be locked up forever. Now let's see if I can actually do this. Okay, it's two. Can I shoot it off the hook? No, I can't. 
and release and release come on okay this is uh stabilize it's got too much power now wow And oh, let me do this off camera. Okay, I got it. I just took my time. As you can see, it took a whole minute and ten seconds. I know. All right. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, oh, the hydraulic press. We have the pistons. These are actually quite interesting pistons. You can uh, specify how long far they go, and they go like I think like a total of like ten blocks. So it's actually pretty good. Four hydraulic presses are welded together to form this piston and can lift attached components to the, to a maximum height of a meter. Basically what I just said. Now, what is this? Oh yeah, it's the the barbell. Okay, transfer the barbell to a highlighted area. Pass the checkpoint within 30 seconds. Okay, fairly simple. Let's actually see where I sit in this thing. Yeah. So what I think I need to do. That's gonna be heavy. Is I gotta get my buoyancy back for one. Do that and that. Get rid of that, and we'll actually get rid of this hook because I don't need it anymore. Uh, what I will do is grab a piston. I'm hoping this is gonna be good. Actually, no. Let's put it in the back here. Uh, hit the wrong button. Actually, no, I didn't. You can't actually delete while you're in build mode. And then, of course, uh, hotkey is H for extend. Uh, plunger distance. You can. Specify how high it goes up to a total of 2.0, which no idea what that is. All right, so there's that. Then gotta have something on there to actually pick it up. Uh, let's actually not do that because I notice stuff like that tends to be a little on the flimsy side. But I do have the iron stuff. It's gonna be very heavy. So maybe we'll try this. Uh, no, let's put block on here, like that, and then we'll go over here, and then we'll put these up, like so. So then when I get into the water, push H and it lifts up. Very wonky physics. Okay, this thing does actually looks fairly light. So let's see if I can't even get underneath it. Oh, come on, really? Hmm. Okay, I guess I gotta move that. Okay, well, I've been working on this one for a while and a few redesigns, I think. Uh, this is sort of the right idea. But the problem is I'm having buoyancy issues. So what I think I might have to do is I might have to sort of redesign something new. But I think we'll do that in the next episode. Because we're getting about that time for an episode. And I also need to take a bit of a break to rethink about how I'm going to do something like this. Like I said, it's going to be a full redesign. But with that, I thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave me a like. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Later.